I'm going to be separating iron or co copper and then having iron attached to it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take all these pennies, put these in this bowl, put salt and vinegar in it, let it lay for five minutes, and all the, this should be clean. And that's the first thing I'm going to demonstrate it. I should note out that all these pennies are older than the year 1982. That's an important factor. If they're older than 1982, it's not going to work. So what I do, is open a bottle of vinegar, fill it up in a ceramic bowl like this. So you have a decent amount of vinegar and then you have to pour a tablespoon of salt. Once it's full, you dump it in there, and then you take the pennies, the old pennies, and let them lay in there. What this should do is that the salt and vinegar have compounds in it that are going to take the copper, that's going to take the copper, some of the copper off the pennies. And once I do that, in five minutes, I'm going to put an engalganized nail in it, and it should have a copper-like color. Good. Okay, so the five minutes are up. I'm going to take the pennies out with a spoon. So as you can see, close up on this. Um, it took some of the rust off. It's a bit clean. It's a bit more clean now. So it, the salt and vinegar absorbs some of the copper. And now this is important because I'm going to put two iron agonized nails, ungalvanized. Uh, ungalvanized nails, in here and leave it in for about a half hour. If when I when I put this in here in about a half hour, and I'm going to set the clock now. There should be a copper-like color in there. After the 30 minutes, there's going to be some brown on there. If you <laughs> Is, are we going? You're going to cut this out, right? Oh, God. <coughs> okay. <laughs> Y'all yeah, cut that part out. Um, okay, one, if you look closely, if you look closely at the nails, there are bubbles. And there are bubbles because the iron in the nails are attracting with the copper ions that are in the salt and vinegar from the pennies. And once, and once they're getting attracted, the nails will turn a different color. Okay, so as you can see, the color has changed. This is what an ungalvanized nail looks like before. This is what it looks like after. As you can see, they're less shiny. The colors are different. And these have a bit of a copper-like color. A bit of a copper-like color. And what happened was the iron and the copper ions mixed, and they were able to make copper-like color on the iron on galvanized nail.